Hello everyone, it's Angela from the Chaotic Life Love Planner. Welcome back to my channel, or welcome if you're new. In today's video, we are going to be planning out the week of Monday, January 16th to Sunday, January 22nd. This is my Moxie Life Vertical Planner. I did get the Chevron cover, which I absolutely love. I am still working on my goals for 2023. I did put my name in it, and I did work on some things like the Life Compass. Um, let's see how far I've gotten. Some intentions. I have not put, I, I know my word of the year, I just haven't put it down yet. And then I worked through a little bit of, um, I thought there was one other page I did. I guess not. And I'm just working on putting some of my annual goals on sticky notes for right now and picking my focus words. So I am working on it. I am not quite ready to, uh, you know, share all the things yet, but hopefully soon. The kit we're going to be using this week is from Orange Umbrella Co. It is the Winter Birds Kit. It's gorgeous. I believe this is the mini kit that I got. And I absolutely just love it. It does like scream winter to me, even though we really haven't had much of a winter in January, at least here in the Chicago area. So it is all good. But look at this gorgeous washi. I didn't get a ton um, I didn't of add-ons. I did get the date covers, but we're going to just try and see if we can make this work. So I'm pretty excited about this. So I did my pre-planning in my ultimate budget planner um, by papers by Jessica Ann. So that, I've been doing that for the last few weeks and it's really been working nicely. I actually just use like these weekly pages in that planner just as like a an area to jot things down and all of that sort of thing. And I like that. So, all right, I think we're just going to go ahead and start and see what happens. I don't really have like a specific plan for how I want this to go. So let's see how this will look. I think, oh yeah, that'll be fine. That will cover those up. So you may notice that I did some work on my desk and like I have this new little backdrop right here. Actually, all it is is um, like bulletin board. What do they call it? Mm, trying to decide if I want to trim this right here. I think I will. Like a shiplap bulletin board like paper is what it is. And I got it from Michael's and it was like $9, I think for a big giant roll of it. So I just taped it to my desk and I really, oh, that was, there we go. I really like it. Um, I think I'd had something similar to this when I was in Alaska and I liked that better than what I had on my desk before. So we are back to the good old tried and true. I think I had poster board then, but I cannot find a piece of white shiplap poster board. They had one piece of it at Michael's yesterday, but it was all like wrinkly and yucky and just not good. So we obviously did not want to go with that piece of poster board. So I went with the shiplap bulletin board cover instead and then I just set the rest of the roll aside um, so that you know if well let's be real here Lucas is probably going to come in here and color on it one day when I'm not um, aware of what is happening so when that happens because I know it will then I'll have some extra shiplap to replace it with so I did go ahead and already put the dates on the date covers um, before I started filming just to kind of make things move along a little quicker. There are a lot of add-ons that you can get to go with this kit from Orange Umbrella Co. and they ship super quickly so if you're still looking for a nice pretty winter kit then I would recommend that you go order. I will have their shop linked in the description box down below um, so that you can find them easily. All right, I have one full box. I mean, there's like washi, a ton of washi that you can get. I mean, there's deco, there's journaling deco. I'm telling you, there's so many different things, but I am trying to be mindful of my sticker purchasing this year. Um, I've also, in addition to my 
goals for 2023. I've been working on getting my stickers organized and I'm not quite there yet, but like I have stickers for planners that I don't even have the right size for anymore. So time for that to go. All right. I think I want to cover this up. So let's see how this will work. So anyways, I have a bunch of daily duo kits that are in the seven by nine size. And I don't use that size planner and I haven't actually for a couple of years. So I was thinking about offering them as a giveaway, but I don't know if I have that many viewers that would, that use the seven by nine daily duo size. So we'll see how that goes. I'm still working on that, but it does feel good to be pulling the kits out that I know I'm not going to use. And then adding in the ones that I still have because like I have monthly kits for April, so I don't need to buy any monthly kits for April this year because I already have them from last year or whatever year it was that they didn't get used. So I want to just be mindful of that sort of thing. Okay. So this is for habits. So I'm not sure how I want to mark that. So I'm going to leave that right there, I think, but up here, I'm just going to put the sticker and then I will use the this week label right here. I may end up changing that, but for now, we're just going to leave it. Okay. There's that. And then I'm going to go ahead and mark my dinner slot. I think, I think maybe we'll just do dinners down here. I didn't buy thick washi for this kit, but a lot of times I like to put the thick washi down here and it looks really pretty, but I did not purchase that this time. So I think this spot will work just fine for dinners. You'll see um, this week, my husband is coming back home from work. So I will actually have to um, cook a little bit more than I do when he is gone. And you know, Liberty is living the life down at Disney World right now in the Disney College program. So it's pretty much only Michaela and I for two weeks at a time and Lucas, but you know, he doesn't eat all the things. <laughs> he's doing better, but he's still pretty picky. So anyways, my cooking levels are different for the two weeks that everybody's gone compared to the two weeks that everybody is here. All right. So there is that. I really like how that is coming together so far. I'm not entirely sure what I'll use this spot for, um, but we will figure that out as we go along. All right. So I'm just going to go ahead and start putting in the plans for the week. So I do have, oh, I know what I wanted to do. Let's see. Oops. I pulled out some stickers that I thought I might use. I have this um, sheet of holidays from Orange Umbrella Co. And I wanted to use the Martin Luther King Jr. Day sticker because that is today. And I, and I, it did say it up here in the top, but, um, you know, I covered it up with the washi. So I'm just going to use one of these labels right here. And we'll mark this right here. There is that. I don't have anything going on today. Michaela's off today, but she is, I think she's, I don't know if she's, she has some kind of appointment today. So she's not here. Lucas is taking a nap. I'm going to use these custom scrap stickers that I have from Simply Smith stickers to mark Lucas's speech. He does have speech on Tuesday at 11.30. He gets that speech um, session through the school. So I'll just put this here and then I'll add in 11.30 in a little bit. And then he has it again at 12.30. Maybe we'll use this appointment. No, I'm going to keep them the same. 
He has it on Wednesday at 12.30. This, I thought we were going to have to be done with speech because there was some issues with the insurance, but I guess they got it all figured out because they called me last week to say he could come back, which I'm really happy about that because he loves this speech therapist. Like, loves, loves, loves her. All right, I have a couple of errands that I need to do on Wednesday after his speech therapy appointment. So let's see how I want to mark that. I have to go buy dog food and I have to pick up Liberty's um, glasses. So I think I'll just use a box like this. And sorry, I know I have you guys at quite a bit of an angle. And then I'll just use these little dots right here. This is an Erin Condren stencil. I love this. I use this like every day. So dog food. L Libs glasses. Of course they came in like the day we got to Florida. And then it seems like there was one other errand that I had to run, but I can't remember what it is right now, but I have space for it. And then let's see, let me use this one. A very late Wednesday night, I get to go to the airport and pick up my husband and my son because they will be home from work. I think it's like 11 something at night they get in which is definitely not ideal. And to be honest with you, you never know if they're going to be able to get out of Juno. Um, so yeah, we'll just have to see if they don't get out of Juno, then I probably won't be able to get them until Thursday, but that does happen sometimes. It's actually happened just before. I can't remember if it was Thanksgiving or Christmas, but anyways, there is that. Now we are on to Thursday. Thursday is trash day. So I'm going to use this little script right here, and then I think I'm just going to use this. It's like a bill tracker, but I really like having the boxes that have the check mark or like the check box on them because I like to check things off. We're planners. We like to check things off, right? So we'll put this one down here. No paydays this week. Let's see. And now we are on to Friday, which I don't have anything going on on Friday. Saturday, Mike and Ben have a uh, So I have a question. What do you guys use these boxes for? Like, I just don't know what this extra space up here. I don't know. I guess you could like stick one of these labels up here if you wanted to, and then you'd have a couple of spaces to fill things in. But anyways, that was just a little side note. So Saturday, Mike and Ben are going to Detroit for a Red Wings game. I think they have two games when they're home this time. Sunday, we will go to church. We did not get to go to church this week because Lucas was sick. Um, I guess I probably could have went, but I didn't. So there's that. I have my little church icons right here from Simply Smith stickers. We'll probably do the 1035 service. Um, that seems to work really well for him um, with the amount of kids that are there um, for children's church that he really, yeah, that works good for him. Can be a little overwhelming. So I have this little movie night sticker. I think we'll probably do it on Friday. Actually, I could use, let me see. Let's see something here. I really want to go see the Whitney Houston movie. I'm pretty sure it is out. That's not terrible. So I want to do that on Friday with my husband. All right, let's see what else do I have here that I want to mark. I want to use this Hello Weekend sticker right here. 
because it's cute. So I think we're going to do that down here. I think that'll look really cute. And then use the little trash icon because why not? I really like these scallop labels. I need to figure out something to do with them. I'm looking to see what else there is. So on Saturday, I think I'm going to change this one around a little bit. I think I'll put this because it is a four hour drive plus a one hour time change. So let's see how I can make this work. I feel like it's been forever since we went to a game. I don't think we've went since mm, maybe the beginning of December. I'm sure we went the beginning of December, but Ben is gonna just be going to both of the games with Mike this time. So maybe next time I'll get to go, which is fine. I, it's not a big deal. Okay. So there is that. I have this little Frye girl. I haven't used her in a long time. She is from Planner Kate. I told you guys I was, uh, sorting through my stickers and I found some fun things and I'm like, oh my gosh, I have not used her in a long time. So we'll just kind of put her right here. I think she'll be all right. Yeah, that's cute. Oh, this one. I need to clean my floors. Like it is raining today and it's disgusting. So today is not going to be the day that I clean the floors because it doesn't make, it's like trying to shovel your driveway when it's still, um, snowing. So I'm not going to do that trying to figure out which color I want to use here. I think we'll just use this one. But I do need to mop, and it is going to have to be tomorrow, so. Which is fine. Tomorrow is Tuesday. So I will probably do that tomorrow afternoon while Lucas is napping. Because it definitely does not make any sense to also do that while he's awake. <laughs> I have these uh, water plant scripts. This is font two from Alexander and Co. Plans. And then I'm going to use one of these other checklists right here. That will probably happen tonight, actually, because Mikhail is home. So she can help me with that because I need to get her opinion about a couple plant issues that we seem to be having. I need to clean out the fridge. It is awful. But I don't want to do that until Thursday because I want to be able to put it out for the trash, if that makes any sense. I'm sure you all understand. We do not want our trash can full of stinky food. So we'll put that there. Today I am working on laundry, so I have this little laundry doodle girl from Simply Smith Stickers. It seems like I'm always working on laundry. I'm sure you guys are like, really? Again? You're working on laundry again? Yes, yes. We have 10 puppies in this house, and you know, all the people it seems like. <laughs> so there is that. Cute. I like the way this is coming together. I do kind of wish I had gotten like the full boxes, but... I didn't, so that is okay. All right, so what I'm going to use this full box for right here is my YouTube videos for the week. So I'm just going to use this little film from Planner Kate. This is the number if you are interested. And then I'm going to use my trusty stencil right here. I'm going to aim for three videos this week. I do kind of have some things that I need to work on in order to make that happen. But of course we know the first one's going to be a plan with me. And then we will see what I end up with for other videos. Let's go ahead and use the sticker right here. I need to 
since the boys are going to be gone on Saturday, spend some time in my planners, which will have to be during Lucas's nap time because that does not happen when he is awake. And then if we don't go to the movies this night, we will end up going on Sunday, I'm sure. I'm probably going to need to pick up some groceries. And there is a grocery trip sticker right here. So let's go ahead and use the... I don't necessarily want to do it on Friday. I almost would rather do it on Thursday, but I don't think it's going to happen. So we'll, we'll do a little bit of layering. Let's see if I can make this work. Here is the little grocery bag. There we go. That's cute. All right, so that might actually be it, which is unfortunate because I still have some really cute stickers left, but I don't have a bunch of appointments this week. I pretty much have what I, I've pretty much marked what I need to mark. So yeah, I don't, I don't know. I mean, this is basically just my overview since I do use a daily planner as well. So this might be it. I guess it would have been a good week for me to get some deco, but I didn't. So there's that. I do have one other thing I need to mark on Wednesday. Um, let's see. We'll go ahead and use this one. I'm going to mark it down here because I'm not exactly sure how it's going to come, what time it's going to come, or anything like that. But I just want to mark... I want to have a way to mark that my, I have a new medication that I'm going to be starting and I just want to be able to mark that right here. It's supposed to be here on Wednesday. I think that's going to be it, you guys. I mean, it's just a pretty basic week, but you know, sometimes that happens. So if you're new here, please do hit that red subscribe button. I would love it if you would consider sticking around. Please do give this video a big thumbs up. I have all the links to all the things in the description box down below, and I'll see you next time. Bye, guys.